We began at six tonight with the search for the suspect in a violent attack in a, on a woman on a trail. This happened along the Fano Creek Trail in Beaverton, right near the Garden Home Recreation Center. And deputies fear she might not be the only victim. KGW's Mike Benner is live near where it happened. Mike, this happened back in July. Yeah, Laurel, uh, four weeks ago today, to be exact, detectives have spent the last month gathering evidence, doing interviews, trying to track this guy down on their own. They haven't been able to, so they're now enlisting the help of the public. In fact, they've released a sketch of the suspect. I want you to take a look at it. The suspect is described as a white guy between 40 and 50 years old. He was clean shaven with long, dark hair. Authorities say on the afternoon of July 19th, he struck up a casual conversation with a 28-year-old woman on the Fano Creek Trail. Moments later, the man pulled the woman into the brush and sexually assaulted her multiple times. Fortunately, the woman was able to fight off her attacker and run away. Investigators want to catch this guy and get him off the streets. This is a terrifying situation. We obviously want to capture this person. Um, we have done thorough interviews with the victim. We have collected physical evidence and we have compiled a sketch, composite sketch of the suspect. All right, another look at the suspect. On the afternoon of the attack, we're told he was uh, wearing khaki shorts, a gray t-shirt, and brown flip-flops. As always, if you have any information about this case, you're urged to contact the Washington County Sheriff's Office.